yo yo what up people what's going on uh back again we're back again episode 17 uh the midweek talking about episode the what uh 117 sorry not 17 okay. 117 is what i meant <laughs> are you sure it's not 116 can you said 115 nah. last week blood no nah, yeah. i believe it's 117 if i'm not mistaken i could be yeah, mistaken that is. Nah, is it is it is 117 yeah, yeah, there yeah, we go 117 of uh, back again, uh, we're talking about the, the Car- Carabao Cup uh, games and all that. But before we do that, let me check in with my guy, Troops, bro. How you doing, my G? I'm good, man. You understand? It was a good performance. You get me? Obviously, Xhaka, the fucking idiot. But we've we've come to expect that. But yeah, man, I'm in a good, I'm in a good place, blood. You get me? There we go. There we go. Now, what are you telling post- me? Post wedding, I'm good, bro. I'm good. I, uh, I, I literally just got done making dinner between the game and now. I got done making dinner downstairs over there. My roommate, so I made salmon, and my roommate was was trying to tell me that my salmon is, uh, I think it was kind of fucked up or smelling a bit too fishy. Apparently, you salmon see, you see what I'm saying, blood. I don't fuck with the fish thing, fam. You understand <laughs> that? Let, let, let me tell you something. Yeah, if I ever come over to your house, yeah, you, you better make sure you're not cooking no fish in a dog. <laughs> you so, so I get. I get it. I get it from this one place where I get the whole, the whole, like the whole fucking tray thing for real, real, real cheap. So I just oh, chop I it up it, into, into things. So I have meal, meals for days. So if that's ruined, or if you guys see me bolting uh, left a little bit for like five seconds, that's it's probably because of that salmon. But it tasted. I mean, it was it tasted good. So I guess we'll wait and see if my my stomach holds up. Pray but, for yeah. Uh, let's, let's get into the business, bro. Let's get into the business. So uh, we were up at Anfield for the first leg of the for the Carabao Cup. Of course, it was delayed. It was the one that was delayed because of the false positives that uh, came out of the Liverpool camp last week. So we got to play it today while other people were playing their while the Chelsea ones were, were playing their second legs. Uh, good performance from the boys. The big moment in that game was the Xhaka, was the Xhaka thing, the Xhaka red card. But uh, yeah, generally the game, bro. What were your what were your feelings on the game? Xhaka nearly cost us. You understand? Normally, you go down to ten minutes at Liverpool, you lose the game. You get me? If it's a cup, if it's a cup competition, you're out the cup. But somehow, we still have a big, big chance. You get me? Bringing them back to the Emirates at nil nil. Our fans at home, under the lights, it's gonna be a great atmosphere. I might have to pull up, blood. You get me? Oh, you're going to go? I might have to pull up, blood. Because I ain't gone since I've been back um, this time around. Obviously, because when I came back, it was wedding we- wedding yeah, motive. Wedding, wedding season. So now that I've sorted that all out. Um, semi-final, bro. You get me? It's a big game, blood. <clears throat> you understand? I might have to pull up, but... I was just very proud of all the team, blood. Mm. Apart from Xhaka. You get me? And am I surprised that Xhaka... No, you understand? Like, it's got to the point where you can't even say, I can't believe this, blood. Because you better believe it. Because it's been happening and it will continue to happen, blood. Do you understand? This is the man that people are trying to put forward to be the captain of our club, blood. This man smoking butch. This man is 29 years old, blood. He's not 21. He's not 22. He's not, you understand, where he'll get he'll, he'll get the, the errors out of his game. This guy is prone to errors, blood. He is a liability, blood. He is a liar as well, blood. I do not believe him when he's telling me that his flipping mother gave him the keys when he was a youth man instead of his big brother. Because apparently, on my life, bro, and apparently he had the keys to the house instead of the big brother as a youth. Bro, I'm not hearing that, bro. You get me? Because he would have lost the fucking keys, blood. Yeah? He would have lost the fucking keys, blood. Yeah? And as long as he is in that midfield, blood, there's always going to be that What's Xhaka going to do? Four in the back of your mind, blood. You get me? Because you can say Gabriel's far forward, Ramsdale's run, like Ramsdale coming out and then stopping has affected Xhaka. Xhaka's looked at Xhaka about three times, blood. Yeah? He can fully think about his move, what he's going to do. How is he going to attack this situation, blood? You understand? What does he do, blood? He turns into Luke Kane, bro. You get me? Prime Luke Kane, blood. You understand? Hitman with the special, bro. Took him out, blood. Mid air, you understand? Mid air, bro. You get me? Like Chop City, fam. You understand? It was a mad thing, bro. You get me? And I really think that, like, you could tell from the players' reactions, blood. They were like, "What the fuck, like again? Yeah. Like really? 
Like, what is wrong with you type of thing, blood? And I think, I think we gathered strength from that incident, blood, because the way we stifled Liverpool, blood, and <clears throat> uh, resorted, they, um, they resorted to long shots, blood. You get me? Their first shot on target was the 91st minute when Ramsdale saved the Minamino shot. You get me? The, the one before he skied it right in the middle of the goal. You get me? <clears throat> when Ramsdale come out and fluffed it and it dropped him. You understand? Wide open. Worse than Obama is. <laughs> Terrible miss, blood. You get me? That's the game on a plate, blood. You understand? The goalkeeper's nowhere near the goal, blood. You get me? You got Ben White on the line, but the way it's dropped him as well, you just boom, volley that. You get me? But we know that Minamino is not that guy. You understand? It's a good thing it dropped to him, blood. Because if it was Firmino or Yacht or one of them, they probably would have top bins it. You understand? <clears throat> but you get me? That's how long it took for them to create a chance, blood. It took them to stoppage time. You understand? We was comfortable. We were comfortable, bro. And in the 90 minutes, in the actual 90, we created the best chance, blood. The soccer opportunity. When, when Tierney's putting that great ball over the top and Van Dijk, Van Dijk, I eat that, blood. Because Van Dijk, he's dodged when the ball, blood, when it's coming in. Out, right? You get me? And it's Saka, if you had a better touch, that's 1-0, blood. You understand? We're going back to the Emirates with a 1-0 lead. You get me? This clock guy, he's getting pressured in the interviews, blood. Man telling me false positives are pulling out, flipping symptoms, blood. How can you have symptoms with false positives, blood? Yeah, right? Yeah, he's like, oh, the guys, they, they didn't have false symptoms, but they came back bad. I'm like, is this, what? Now is this guy all right? Bro, and, 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 and we are oh, still... Yeah. And we are still not getting an investigation, blood. So it shows you that the corruption is real, blood. Yeah. You get me? The corruption is real, blood. If you're at the top, then you get me, blood. You can, you understand? Under the table, boom, bang, bing, Bob's your uncle. You understand? You get you get majority rubber the green. You understand? But I was just very proud of the players, blood. And I believe that we have a big chance in the second leg. You get me? Because they're going to have no Salah, no Mane, no Keita. Their man, they will still be unavailable. And you saw that they were, what's the word, blood? They were toothless in the final third. You get me? They never had no bite, blood. It was just bare bark. <laughs> and they weren't even no big bark, like a Rottweiler or a pit bull. It was some chihuahua bark, blood. <laughs> you understand? Yeah, they, the only bark came in like the final, what? Was five, ten, five minutes? It was what literally, it was like five minutes. It was literally stoppage time. Yeah. That's when the chances, you understand, Maka? We're tired. We're fully saying, all right, cool. We're going to defend the box, blood. We came even deeper than what we was because what we was doing was like a 40 yard. We were playing the pitch at 40 yards. You understand? We 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 play in our 40 yards. You have to brought this down. When it got to the 90 minutes, man, they said, fuck that, we're going to the box, blood. So obviously we're deeper, so they're gonna come more in it. You understand? But we managed to get through it. You get me? Good result, good performance. It's just inconsistency, blood. You get me? The yeah. Man City game, fantastic. The, the, the Nottingham Forest game, fucking abysmal. Mm. This game, fantastic. What are we going to get on Sunday now, blood? Mm. You get me? I know it's a North London derby, but when we go to their ground, the shithole, we don't really play how we play at Arsenal, at the Emirates. When we play at the Emirates, we play possessed. You get me? There's, there's, you understand? Shout out Vince McMahon. You have no chance in hell when you come Emirates. Bro. You get me? When we go there, we basically have no chance in hell, blood. You understand? Mm. Bare draws, you get me, L's. We ain't won there since fucking 2014 in the league. We ain't won there in all competitions since uh, 2015 Flamini League Cup. So you get me. We're going to have to go down there and, and, and perform correctly, blood. And you understand, with this fucking idiot Xhaka getting sent off, that's going to fuck man up, blood. And it, I just show, it just shows you why he's an idiot, blood. Because even to make that challenge, yeah, I would have rather have gone 1-0 down, yeah? Because you might not even go 1-0 down because you're going 1-1 one -on -one with Ramsdale. You're not going 1-1 one -on -one with Leno. You're going 1-1 one -on -one with Ramsdale. Ramsdale could... As, as, there's, there's an that, 80% chance... That's probably chance. what he was thinking when he... There's an 80% chance that Ramsdale can save it, blood. You're making that challenge knowing that the midfield's light, knowing that we have Tottenham next and then we have Liverpool next, yeah? And you're making them kind of challenges, blood. You're not even thinking, bro. Like, there was a comment in the stream and it said that Granit Xhaka is the only player who is experienced but has no experience, blood. You understand? Yeah. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna play devil's advocate a bit here because I think I I'm gonna try to put myself in his shoes. I think he panicked. He saw he saw he looked over. He saw it was Jota to his side three times. And I mean Granit Xhaka. Every, everyone knows that Granit Xhaka, pace wise, is the slowest midfielder on the fucking planet. 
And I, I think he, he, he honestly pla- he, he panicked. He just saw he was close enough to the ball, stretched out his leg. He was going to try to control the ball. It wasn't, it wasn't like a, a legitimate tackle, which is where, I mean, it's a straight red. If you, it, I'm, I'm not arguing that straight red. Xhaka is an idiot. He did look over, as he said. So I actually, uh, when we, when we went in between the things, I actually got back and actually went to go see it again. He, he looked over, as you said, three times. He looked over. It was just at the final moment where he didn't look over. So I don't know, man. <clears throat> Question for you. This performance, bro. I mean, you saw at the end, Martinelli, Saka, and them. Do you think we worked? We, we, we might have uh, taken a bit too much out of the tank going forward? Nah, man. Performance? Nah, man. We had 10 men in it. You get me? If we never had 10 men, then that's not happening. You understand? The only thing with the Xhaka sending off is Gabriel steps into the midfield and he tries to win the ball and he doesn't win the ball. And when he wins that ball, he comes out of the centre of defence. You get me? So that gap is left for Xhaka. But there's this thing that we do that when Gabriel goes forward, Xhaka slots in. So Xhaka knows that his role is to slot into that centre-back role, into that left-hand side. But he looks three times for Xhaka, and before he makes the challenge, he don't look. He just sticks his foot out, blood. That's stupidity, bro. You've looked at him three times, so you know where he is. So you know he's coming across you like that. And then what do you do, blood? Puts, puts, puts the leg out. Yeah, no, I mean, yeah, stupid, stupid. It was stupid, but I was just playing, trying to trying to get in his shoes, trying to probably to think through what he's thinking. Uh, but yeah, that that Jaka incident was dumb. Arteta, bro, Arteta, young squad, <clears throat> young squad. Look at what he's getting out of him. Do you, do you think? Uh, what do you what do you what do you think of the manager's performance uh, with this with the squad tactically? What do you mean? I mean, we go down 10, we go down 10 men, you know, 20, 25 minutes into the game. We, we have to, we have to fight it out. 70 minutes, 70 minutes is uh, what do, what did you think of his tactical performance his setups and all that? I mean, he just said to them, play from 40 yards. You get me. So he didn't really say to them attacking it. He just defensively set us up, set us up sound. You understand? But <clears throat> yeah, he done well. You get me. We just need more consistency, like I said. Because it's yeah. easy to do that with 10 men. You get me? To set the stall and just say defend. You understand? It's, it's, it's to get the consistency in the game now. Yeah. No, no. With you. It's going to be tough, man. It's, it's, it's a young, young, inexperienced squad. And the guys that we're meant to be counting on, the, the Jacques and them, the, the experienced players that we're meant to be counting on, keep letting us down, so... I don't know, man. I really don't know. Now we got a crisis in central midfield, bro. What are we? What are we gonna do there? What are we gonna do there? Who are you thinking? There's a certain man. There's a certain man. That, Odegaard can't good. play because he's yeah. got Corona. He tested positive today, so he's out for Tottenham. Also, oh, the test was today. Yeah, he's out for Tottenham. That's confirmed. So it's gonna be Lukonga. And pro, I don't know, bro. What do you what do you think of Jack Wilshire for the for the for the half of the season? I see the Arsenal Twitter and they're saying Wilshire sign him up for the North London Derby. He would do a job. Um, he is an Arsenal boy through and through. He hates Tottenham, but he hasn't played for a long, long time, blood. A long, long, long time, blood. And to throw him into that game with that intensity. I don't think it's right, blood. So you would you would rather you he, he is training with the squad though. You would rather you'd rather use player playing there than ahead of him or bro. Jack is a dickhead. Someone out of position. Jack is a dickhead. Jack has fucked man up. You get me. The yeah. only option I can think is Callum Chambers. You get what about me? but then but then it's fucked up because we need him at right back. Cedric Cedric's gone. You understand? Cedric's injured. Cedric's gone. Tommy Tommy's dead. I don't so want Chambers fucking. I don't want fucking Cedric to play anyway. I'm hoping Tommy Asu's fit so we can have the proper back four. But I don't know, blood. The only it's 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 looking like Chambers and Lokonga, blood. That's that's the only it's the only options, blood. You get me? We're 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 light, bro. Why did he loan Ainsley? You understand? Like it's stupidness. We're looking now and we're like, you understand? We're in a predicament. I don't get it. I don't. I honestly do not do not get you can't it at put, all. Like you can gas up Wusha, da 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 da. But he ain't played for time, blood. He ain't played for years, bro. And you're putting him into a must-win game because we have to win this game. If we lose this yeah. game, we're top four's done. 
We're in trouble, yeah. You understand? We're in trouble, blood. You get me? So <clears throat> you can you understand it's, the Wilshire thing is Wilshire thing's more like a hope. couple. Oh, sorry. Go I on. don't think it's I don't think and we have to if we if Wilshire was gonna play, we have to register him by midday on Friday. You understand? We would have to register him by midday. Oh, it's on not, Friday. it's not, it's not before, it's not a couple hours before kickoff. No, it's Friday. You, no, it's before the match fixtures, blood. So before that, you have to before midday Friday, we have to register him. Oh yeah, because in is the Friday, in yeah. the squad, not the not the starting eleven or or, or yeah. the, the in the Arsenal squad. Yeah, because he's not. He's we not have under. to register him by tw- by. So that's not going to happen, bro. You get me? So because that means that we're going to fucking Arteta's fucking chatting to him right now, and then he's going to come in the morning sign his deal, and then they're going to try push it through to the Premier League. That's not going to happen, bro. Mm-hmm. You get me? There's not enough time as well, bro. So you get me. And, and me personally, I wouldn't even take Wilshaw for, for until the end of the season. You get me? I don't. I don't think. You understand? He's he, he's not at the level he once was. You get me? Training and playing is is two complete different things. You get me? And we're in a like like I said, bro. The only real option is Chambers, bro. But that's what do you, that, what, that, what that's, do you... that's that's if Tommy Asu's fit. If Tommy Asu's not fit, then it's probably Patino, blood, because he was on the bench tonight. So it's probably Patino and fucking bro for a derby, <clears throat> bro. Who the fuck else do we have? Who the fuck else do we have, blood? Arteta can't fucking play there. <laughs> yeah, you might, you might have to, you might have to sign a player coach, player coach. Jesus Christ! You know what? You know what we could do. What do you think of this? Ben White, Ben White in central midfield and then put uh, put Rob Holding to replace him there. Nah, man. Nah, man. Nah, man. He gets... Nah, man. He gets spun a bit too easy. If he's getting spun in the midfield, they're straight on the back four, black. <clears throat> I'd rather Callum. I'd rather Callum in there, if anything. You get me? That only guy thing really does fuck everything up, huh? We're fucked, bro. The Shaka guy's oh, a prick, yeah, blood. Yeah. He's actually a dickhead, bro. The Shaka guy's a dickhead, blood. He's a full-on dickhead, blood. This guy's fucked man over, bro. We're going into this game with literally no midfield, blood. Do you understand? And they won't even cancel the game, bro. They won't cancel the game. We got 10, we got 10 people missing, troops. They won't cancel the game. They don't give a fuck about Arsenal. We got 10 people missing. They don't care. If we was Man City and we had four people missing or even five, they'd be like, all right, we'll call it off. What is it? Before before today, before the kickoff, was it what was 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 nine, right? It was nine, mm-hmm. eight. Add two more, potentially. Saka, Saka, and Saka, and uh, Saka, and uh, what's his name? And Cedric. Mm. That's half, that's, that's, that's Cedric literally and, the situation. But Cedric and Saka, their injuries, they're not Rona. Not everyone's got Rona. Yeah, but doesn't that doesn't that doesn't that also count as as the players available too? I, I believe the injuries count. Klopp try use it, but Arteta won't use it. Arteta will just use Rona. He's saying no excuses. So it's looking like Patino and fucking Lokonga blood. It's gonna be an oh, interesting God. Sunday afternoon, blood. It's gonna oh, be very God. interesting. I'm gonna have this fucking woman next to me as well blood so it's just, oh jesus Christ. oh oh yeah you don't hey jeez you're doing it you're doing it at home you're doing it at home <laughs> oh it is not fun at all yeah this bro, the way been... my energy has changed like when you see the fucking combine 11 bro and the energy now bro oh my days like mm. i was on smoke blood and now i'm just like oh shit this could go left blood because this little pussy old ex is telling me be a man are gonna be back for them for the for the fucking derby. And we're just our players are dropping out every fucking day, blood. You understand? I'm I'm pfft, oh my days, bro. Oh my days, blood. Oh, it's gonna be it's gonna be a real, real, real tough one, man. Real tough one. But yeah, I mean, good performance from Arsenal. I guess the result, the result was the result was good. The Jaka, the Jaka thing was the only black mark um, on the game. Other Arsenal news uh, were linked to uh, to Arthur, Arthur from Juve. Apparently, they don't want a loan move. They want to, they want us to sign him permanently. Uh, your thoughts, uh, thoughts on that? Nah, no permanent deal for me. Little loan deal, six months or something. Think he can come in and do a job. He wants to move. 
but they would they, they said that they need to find a replacement. So there's still I think there's still a chance that we can get him on loan. So oh they're the ones that are hold oh oh it's you they're holding it up. Yeah, they need a replacement. Oh gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And then I heard today that um that Bruno guy. They want uh, um, Gie, how do you Grimar, Grimar, uh, Guillamas or something. Guillamas, so how do you I don't know, blood. I just call him Bruno, blood. You get me? <laughs> it's dead, yeah. But um, I think they want. <coughs> I th- they're asking for thirty-five to forty million for him. You get me? So you understand? Far dude, thirty-five to forty. Thirty-five to forty for him. What's his name? Valovic. They're saying they want seventy-five million. Up you front. want seven? It's apparently with him. It's it's the issue with the with the agent, right? The agent fee yeah. is. Apparently the club has agreed. The player himself wants to yeah. go. The agent apparently wants yeah. like ten mil or something. It's crazy. Apparently so we're it's... interested. We're interested in your boy, Yuri Tillemans. That's the one I'm very, very excited about. But what's his name? Brendan Rodgers. Brendan Rodgers came out and he swear he poured water on that one. No, but he poured this, water. On... They, he would do that in it. Yeah. So don't, 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 don't. I mean, don't look into that too much. But I feel like I don't know Tillemans. Tillemans. Even the other brother, who else we linked to? Because he owes, he owes a lot to Rogers, man. To There's what, another, what Rogers has done to him. There's another player we linked with. It was Bruno Vlahovic, Tielemans, Arthur. Ronaldo. Oh, Genie. Yeah, 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 yeah. PSG, PSG, um, PSG loan. You get me? Good thing. Yeah, but no, the, the Tielemans, Tielemans thing, I... I mean, Balogun's I'm, I'm, gone. It's, it's Balogun's gone Middlesbrough. It's a dream. Yep. He's, Mari, he's finally. Mari might go Udinese. So, so I saw, saw that one too. Saw that one too. That's in the works. He was on the bench tonight. Even bench I heard tonight. Cedric was rumoured with a move as well, blood. Okay, the Cedric. The Cedric one is, is what I, I think it was seen. a Spanish team, blood. Might have, been athletic, might have been athletic Bilbao. They wanted him on loan. Might have been one of oh, them, really? blood. Yeah, but I heard even he could be on the way up. When Hopefully did he, 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 he signed? He signed his contract this past summer. Was it this past summer or the one before? I think it was the one before. One before. Yeah. So it could be running down. Yeah. But yeah, that's that's pretty much what's going on in the Arsenal world. Uh, let's look forward now, I guess, to, to the weekend. The, the Tottenham uh, folks, make sure you check out the combined eleven. That's that's already dropped already to get more of the insight uh, insight on the Tottenham uh, Tottenham Arsenal Arsenal uh, Arsenal fixture itself. What about the midweek games, bloody weren't just Arsenal. Oh, the oh, the Chelsea. Sorry, the Chelsea. The Chelsea. Chelsea. Chelsea played yesterday. Chelsea. Sorry, mm. Chelsea played yesterday against uh, against Tottenham. One 0 One 0 The Rudy. I think you watched that game. You see the celebration. It's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Tony. But like Tony with the header. Is he Tottenham standing? are just Tottenham. Are, nah, I think he's gone. Tottenham he's gone to Madrid, shit. right? Tottenham are shit, bro. How's that Conte football working out for you, man? Great. You understand? Uh, I how's that? It. How's that trophy hunt working out for you, man? You get me? What are you gonna come with? Oh, you man, no, you man are out the FA Cup. You ain't winning the FA Cup, blood. I bet I bought my life on it, blood. You ain't winning that, blood. Win what, blood? Dickheads. You'll forever be shit, blood. You understand? And hopefully we slap you even with our fucking. Half fucking team, blood. You get me? But yeah, man, Chelsea fully deserved that, blood. You understand? They were yeah. comfortable. Couple yeah, three, dodgy three, decisions. Uh, three, no. Can't lie, a couple dodgy decisions for Tottenham. Yep. Like going against them, but I enjoyed it because it's against them. I'm you not get whining. Me? I love it. So it. Yeah, blood. So it so it is what it is, blood. Hoyberg doing his best um Yankee impression at spring break. Just diving head first into the pum pum, blood. Just diving head first, blood. You get me? But yeah, man, Chelsea deserved to go to the final. Tuchel has actually got to um, his last six finals. In a row? He, in a row. He's won Jesus. four and lost two. Jesus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now this is... Yeah, this guy This guy is a finals getter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's... he's, he's he, 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 he got the assignment. That fucking Abraham is sent him blood. Trophies is what we're Trophy, about, blood. Yeah, you understand? Is all I care about. Trophy, trophies is all I care about, blood. Right. You get me? And that's another, that's another final for two shower blood. You understand? Thomas, Thomas. Then uh, there was a Premier League game. Uh, West Ham took on uh, took on Norwich. You get to see that? I didn't see that one. I saw um, Southampton. 
Um, oh, the Brentford, the Southampton, Bre- uh, Brentford, the four. Yeah, yeah, Borja, another Borja, great goal. Then, I thought we the youngest so man for... to score four in a row in a in home games in the Premier League, man. Is, yeah, he's the youngest man to score four in a row in home games in the oh, Premier League geez, ever. Really? Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's the youngest so, blood. So, so these because of because of when we recorded confused me. I completely I thought we had talked about the Brentford one in the in the previous episode and all this. Mm. That's the the West Ham one is the one that I know for the fact that we didn't. But yeah, no, so I saw that that four one Broha, James Ward Prowse too with a, with a great ball for the thing. Even that um the goal that that Black Brother scored. Uh, Diallo. That, yeah, Diallo. Diallo. Even though it went in, even though it, it went it, in the off back the, of the, the keeper, right? Yeah, the post. it was uh it was good technique from uh, Diallo mm. hitting hitting the shot from outside yeah, the yeah, box. Yeah. Then West Ham, West Ham was two 0 Jared Bowen, Jared Bowen had a party in that game pretty much. If you, if you didn't get to, if you didn't get to thingy, then uh, Norwich are fucked, the, blood. What's up? Norwich are fucked. Yeah. Ah, they're toast. They Even, are, they're, uh, I heard Campwell might leave. Still stuck on 10, bro. 10 points still they're stuck yeah. on. I heard Campwell might leave, but I heard Max Aaron's is staying. Would you would you take him? Would you take Todd? You Campwell. Nah. You're, you're a big mad. Campwell fan? Aren't you? Wait, I thought you were a big Campwell fan, no? Uh, I, like, I like him. Mm. Pause, but <laughs> you get me. Like, nah, not for Arsenal, blood. He's a player that I look at. I'm like, yeah, I like the way he plays, bro. But he's not a player that I'm like, yeah, I take him out my club. Just, I like watching. I like watching your other teams. Not that yeah. I don't watch all mine. Yeah, one of them. Like he's a gooner in it, so you understand. Big him up. All righty, and then oh, actually, one point, one point. I wanted to touch on the, the Afghan thing. Did you see what happened in that Mali and Tunisia Tunisia game? Bro, I don't know how that referee left the pitch alive, cause just just an embarrassment, and it's actually it's actually so sad. I didn't know there was. I actually didn't know there were worse referees in the Premier League. Till I saw that, bro. Bro, it's 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 so sad because we fight for the African. I, I feel I feel for 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 African people, African football fans, and all that because we fight so hard for this tournament. We fight for people to pay attention to it, for it to be taken seriously. You know, for 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 it to be to to be seen in the same the same. Uh, same level as like the Euros, because I mean, there's a lot of people on the African thing, and then shit like this happens, and yeah, this is what this is what the Afcon Afcon tournament is going to be known for 2022 for this for this refereeing shit instead of you know the the impressive the impressive talent on display. My Zimbabwean boys almost almost beating Senegal. All of that is forgotten. This is all that's going to be remembered. So it's it's sad, man. It's very very sad, unfortunate, mm. but. Cameroon, Cameroon is through. They're looking good. They're the first team to go through the first round. First round games are have just been completed. Cameroon is the first one to to play the second uh, their second game, and they they won that this uh, this afternoon. But that's that's the Afcon. If if you wanna if you wanna hear more about Afcon, I'm doing a lot of that stuff on on my TikTok. Check it out, the Midget Zimbo on TikTok. Right, looking forward. So you you and X did the did the preview. Is there anything you wanted to add on our game that you didn't talk on on that? So we don't. Uh... Not really. You get me. Like it's just who's gonna start, blood. It's it's just. Uh, there we go. Actually, since, since a lot has changed, since a lot has changed between when you take that. I don't now, know who to start, blood. Let's let let's do that at least. I don't know. <laughs> I was like, I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I don't fucking know. Would you oh the god test positive today, blood? What could imagine a man test positive on Sunday? Hey, true. I don't true. fucking know. I don't even know if the game's gonna go ahead. Hey, true. Yeah. I don't I, actually that is actually a very good point because at this point it's getting ridiculous. It, it shouldn't go ahead. Because like the amount of but, people. But with the with the little that we have, can you pull something together? Rams Doe and goal. Um <laughs> Fuck me. Every player you think um, of is <laughs> All right. Ben White, right back. Holding. Gabriel. Tierney. Lokonga. Chambers. I go Chambers. Um, I don't know if Saka's fit, blood. I don't know. Uh, mate. Smith Rowe, I don't know if he's back. Oh my god, blood! What the fuck is going on? Um, what do you even have? All right, I'm good. All right, so fucking. All right, so let's say fucking. All right, Saka's injured. Yeah. All right, Hutchinson, Amari, 
Um, Smith Rowe in the 10. If he's back, he should be back. Smith Rowe in the 10. Uh, Martinelli in the left. On the left, sorry. And then Laka down the middle. Right. I would go Ramsdale. Um, Chambers at right back. Holding with Gabriel, Tierney left back, Lokonga and White. Lacazette in the 10. Getia up front. Jesus Christ. If... If, a man's a man starting in Ketty, you know. Bro, oh, we don't we don't man. have anything. We don't I, have anything. I, like I got Amari in my team, like I like foy. I mean, I, I as much as I love him, he 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 brilliant highlight reel for the under 20. And he's a and winger, all. he's a winger as well. So it's yeah. a bit like it's different. You can throw a winger in who's young to throw a man in the center of midfield. See, and Patino, he's not like a fabricas, bro. You get me. He's not like a cesspool where you can throw him in at that young age because he don't have a Vieira next to him or a Gilberto. He's got fucking Lokonga. Lokonga don't even have a clue what's going on. You understand? But yeah, you you yeah, do your thing. You, you want to get here? So on Ketia up front, Lacazette in the 10, Martinelli on the left. And uh, I mean, if he's fit, Smith Ron, right? For Tottenham, I don't know how I, I mean, I, the 18 year old kids, I don't know how I feel about it. I mean, he's for me, I mean, he's Arsenal through and through. He's, he's gonna be actually, buzzing. you know what? I'm gonna change mine around. I'm gonna change mine around. I just thought of something. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put Tavaj, Tavaj at, at left wing and move Martinelli to the right. Okay, do do Tavaj and Tierney on that left, move Martinelli on the right. That's how I'll go. How do you think, uh, do we get a result? The million dollar question, blood. That is the million dollar question, bro. <sighs> one, one. I don't, I don't think, I don't know, man. I don't, I don't know, man. I think if Saka plays, we win. If Saka don't play, we, we draw. I say if Saka plays 2 1 Arsenal. If Saka don't play 1 1. I say 2 0 us. You're high, fam. Man said 2 0. Man said 2 0. Bro, with the way we are, the you're mad. It's, it's, it's the way we, the way we, the way we buckle down with that 10 men. Against big Liverpool at Anfield. Yeah, but I don't this know, is for a... some reason, for some reason. This, yeah, but remember, guys... they never had no one. These men got Kane, and Kane's he's kind of back, blood. And if he's kind of back, he's gonna score against us, blood. That guy always scores against I, us, I, bro. I, I liked our attitude. Three I things are guaranteed in life: death, taxes, and Kane scoring in Kane the North. <laughs> The thing. I liked, I liked, I liked how we, I liked our performance side of things against uh, the like our grit and all that, and those, those, those are all the all the key ingredients to you know for, for, for you to, to 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 win games and stuff. So that's that's giving me a bit of hope that even even when the chips are down, you know shit shit is hit the fan, things aren't isn't looking good for Arsenal. At least we're buckling down and trying to make shit happen. So that's what's giving me hope. Alrighty, let's go through the other games. The other big game, big big game. Uh, first game on Saturday, seven thirty a.m. here. Uh, Chelsea goes to Man City. What do you uh, What do you think of that one? Man City gonna whoop that ass, blood. Gonna whoop that ass, blood. You understand? A massacre. Pray for, pray for Chelsea. Three one Man City, bro. Three one City, bro. You get me. Thomas Tuchel will probably try to go up there and do flipping eight at the back, blood. It don't work against Man City, blood. They will break you down, blood, yeah? They will break you down, fam. You understand? On my life, bro. It would be a good game, but City 3-1. City 3-1. 
Mm. I say, uh, I say City. I say City two 0 in this one. I think. I think City City will win that. Um, I don't know if the pod is going to be out already when this game is being played, but we'll do it anyway. Uh, Brighton Crystal Palace. Yeah, pod dropping at five o'clock Friday. It should okay, so it should be up. All right. Yeah, yeah. What do you What do you think of that one, Brighton Crystal Palace? I go Brighton. That's a derby as well, you know. That's a derby like Arsenal Tottenham. And Vieira. I don't think v- I think v- Vieira. Vieira's on to Nketiah, bro. But I-, 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 I come out and said that he ain't going nowhere. Yeah, so I saw they were pressing him. They were pressing him in his press conference about Nketiah. Mm. The... I don't I don't think he's going anywhere still. I'm gonna go Palace for this one, I think. I think they'll, they'll be able to sneak a sneak in away victory in this uh, in this game. Aston Villa, Man United. United Villa. goes up to Gerard Land. Villa. Villa just signed Coutinho. Villa, Villa. just signed Luca Dini. <laughs> Villa. Villa. Oh, baby. Villa. Ronaldo's over here whining on national TV, talking about I'm going to finish. Villa. Third. Villa 2-0. They were very unlucky at Old Trafford. And to get Man United so quick, yeah, they're going to fucking nice them up, blood. Trust me. Coutinho as well making his debut against Man United, blood. Coutinho loves to score against them, man, there, blood. Luca Dini. You understand? And they got, um, what's his name as well, blood? Um, who did they get? They got Luca Dina. They got Coutinho. Dino, Coutinho, and who's the third? And they got a third one, I swear, blood. So where they made three signings. Is it two or three they made? Uh, nah, they're interested. Sorry, they're interested in Basuma. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah they're interested in Basuma. That Saka chance, man. Oh, my God. Why or didn't you have a better touch, bro? Up and down, dude. Getting a, getting a win, getting a win at what's it called. Would have been, oof, would have been great. Yeah, but I'm, I'm, on, I'm on Villa too. I think Villa, Villa will beat Man United at home. Mm-hmm. Should be, should be able to beat him. Uh, Leicester, go to Burnley? Uh, I'll go Leicester. Yep. And it's like flipping thing as well. Like, um, man, like Chris Wood, he's got Newcastle blood. So oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. New, yeah, yeah. He, him and um, that Cornet brother is their biggest goal threat. And I think Cornet's out at the minute. So he's, yeah, he's at AFCON. He's at AFCON. Yeah, he, played, he played today, actually. He played to, was it today? Yeah, today. With, with yeah, Coast. Exactly. So, um, yeah, I go Leicester. Yeah, him and Nico Nico Pepe came off the bench too for for Ivory Coast. Um, Newcastle Watford. I go Newcastle. I go for Chris Wood to get a goal in his debut as well. At home? 25, 20, yeah, twenty five million. You know, he's the most expensive player ever in think? the history of the Premier League over thirty years old. Ever. What do you think? What do you ever, think? Of that ever. Ever. Yeah. Chris Wood. It's insane. United paid, you... Man United paid less for Ronaldo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> what do you what do you think of that that that, that mark? It's, it's... I mean, bro, 25, he said, yeah, he said lot, he said his own words, yeah. He he never believed no one would pay his buyout clause of 25 million. Burley never believed it as well, because they were like, we're gonna put it to an amount where not people will come and we'll be like, yeah, 25 mil. They'll be like, nah, 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 less of that. Newcastle are so desperate. Oil money yeah, into the chat. <laughs> that they have gone there and done that. And for six months, it's a good move for Newcastle because they're taking away from a rival. They're weakening a rival. Yes, yes. And strengthening and strengthening yes. their own team. You get me? And Chris was a man that can get goals, blood. You get me? And with him, Wilson, St. Maximum. Also, look at, look at what they have. You it's understand? Kind of um, Almiron. There's a little fight. Joe Willock, if he gets this, if, he, if he starts firing. What's what's the, the Brazilian brother's name? He, they throw him up front sometimes. Joe Linton. Bingo. You get me? There's a couple things where he can work with, isn't it? So, you understand? And if he keeps them up, it will turn out to be a good move. If they go down, he's more than capable to bring them up. up. Yeah. You get me? So he's it. 
I think for the timing of the move and the position they're in, it's a good move for both parties, blood. Obviously, 25 million is a stupid price tag because he ain't nowhere near that, blood. You get me? He's fucking 7 million max. You get me? 5 million player, blood. You get me? That would be in real here, blood. You understand? But... But you also if you look at the bigger like Newcastle, yeah, if you situation. look if you look at the bigger picture, and it is a uh, it's a buyout clause as well, so it's a bit different. It's not like they've gone there and bidded; they've just gone there and paid the buyout clause. So it's a lot yep, different. you don't you don't argue. Yeah, so, it's, so it's a lot different. But if you look at the bigger picture, it's a good move for Newcastle. Also, yep, where the where they're at, man, you can't really attract talent when you're in nineteenth of the thing. So you get me. Those those are get. And I said that to you. I said that to you that um when they got taken over. Do you remember yeah. I said to you that they're not going to yeah. be able to go there and get yeah, like I, Mbappe's and all these man. Like everyone was like, Mbappe's going to go there. Da, da, da. Yeah, I said, bro, I, like they're going to have like the position they're in. It's not like when Abramovich went in at Chelsea and they were in the Champions League. So he could yeah. go out and get a Makaleli in his first season. You get me? Kes, get that kind of cal- a Kesman. You get me? He could go out and get that kind of player plan. Newcastle are fighting relegation plan. So they're going to have to get like the Chris Woods first. Mm. Then when they, if they survive, if they, yeah, Next year is when they friend. can bring in like top 10 players. You get me? So players that are like between 10 and 12, that kind of level. You understand? So you get me? It's it's a building thing. They're going to take years, blood. Mm. Years, bro. You understand? It's, it's a once, long process for them. Once once they're able, once they're able to survive that first relegation. Whew, yeah. If we they survive this year, then they can start moving. Yeah, then, next then now. If they're in the whole season, bro, you, you can convince someone in the summer to come for a season to fight for the Premier League. You can convince yeah, yeah. five, four or five guys, and all of a sudden they're they're in the mix type of deal. Mm. All right. So that's the Newcastle one. Uh Norwich versus Everton. Everton's going to Norwich. Everton, man. Everton. Norwich are fucking dog shit, bro. Just relegate them now, man. Seriously. And don't let them ever come back because they literally come up <laughs> and go bad. down. Come up and go down. Come up and go down. You get me? Uh Southampton Wolves. Southampton, that 4-1 victory, they look good against Brentford, blood. Then uh, the Leeds goes to West Ham on Sunday. That's going to be a good game, blood. They just played as well in the FA Cup. Uh, West Ham beat them. Um, I'll go for another West Ham win. There we go. And then lastly, it's going to be Brentford going to Liverpool. Liverpool, man. Should be it should be easy and yeah that's that's pretty much the weekend looking ahead that yeah that's it because the next ones are on Tuesday then of course there's the Afcon Afcon still going on this weekend I'm going to be watching a lot of that check mm. check check, uh, check me out on on TikTok but yeah uh, people are going to be back live again Sunday the watch along we kick off at eleven thirty here in the States that is 3 30 UK 4 30 in the UK. I always get the fucking UK time wrong. 4 30 in the UK. Four, <laughs> I try to do that. So I do that. I use the the what's it called? I use the 24 hour clock. So I try to do the math and I get mixed oh. up with my 16s and 17s and all that. But yeah, so we're we're 4 30 in the UK. We're gonna be live at four, four in the UK, eleven here in the States. Check us out here on Troops TV at YouTube. Bro, troops, till I see you then, my brother, make sure you enjoy your weekend, bro. Have a, have a good time there and enjoy the first uh, the first few days of married life. You too, bro. <laughs> Man's going as outside. As a, Man's going let outside. me ask you this. Has it changed? Is she still making breakfast, still doing all course, that? Or? Of course. Are you mad? What do you mean? <laughs> you take this for blood. <laughs> Ain't nothing changed, blood. It's like, it's like, of course. Are you mad? I what you never mean? know what 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 you what you get married. Once you get nah, married, that, they blood. might start acting. Start nah, acting less of that blood. The food, the food still running. Sex still running. We're good. Blood. <laughs> you haven't been put on sanctions yet. Whoa, blood! She's got a higher sex drive than me. It's mad. <laughs> Jesus Christ! All right, on that note, I, this is gone. This is gone left now. <laughs> so we're gonna cut it off and right there. Shout out to shout out to the jet ski. Shout out to uh, to Josh. Troops, of course, bro. Always thank you. Then to the fans, everybody that listens, man. Thank you to everybody that listens. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you comment. Leave your comments down below. I usually go through them through there and check out what you guys are saying. So please do leave that. But until we meet again, 
hope we get these three points at the at the North London Derby. Everybody out there, make sure you stay safe, man, and wash your hands. Wash your fucking hands, blood. <laughs>